Hey guys, this is my new Crossman Stinger P311. I bought it on Walmart for $15. It's really cheap and worth it. My, that's what my friend said, so I bought it and here, I'll unbox it. It's a very handy weapon. Its length is just 9 inches. It's a 325 FPS weapon. Uh, it's a spring. It's not a common CO2 ga a gas weapon. It's only a spring gun. The mechanism is repeater. The pulse is spring, and the mag can hold up to 12 bullets. Uh, to ins I'll insert a few bullets. To insert the bullets, first I'll take out some 6 mm BBs. To insert the bullets, you have to pull this spring down, and then you can lock it over there and you have to press this button over here to insert so keep pressing it and insert once you are done inserting the bullets once you are done inserting the bullets there is a button over here in case you have less than 12 bullets but now since I have 12 bullets I won't require it you just have to push in the mag like that and load it once like that and then the gun is loaded then here is the safety of the gun when you pull it up the gun will not be able to fire and when it's down it's able to fire and the bad part about and here this is the mag release button the bad part about this gun is that when you release the mag two bullets always will be like they fall out on their own for example just see this once I press this the mag comes on and here two bullets are falling out that's the bad part about the gun the accuracy of this gun is really good and here I'll just show you a few shots. Okay. Over there are a few cans. Those cans? And I'll be taking a few shots to them. One can hit, another can, oh that one I missed, yeah, so the accuracy of this weapon